that's from Puena, this. That's a vintage piece from If Gas 2, which is uh, by Ikiri. Then you have some Picasso prints. Then you have, you know, uh, it's, yeah, as you said, it's a big mix of everything, you know. How many time do you usually spend in the office? About eight hours, ten hours a day. Ten wow, hours a day. that's a lot. Yeah, but the rest of the time I'm on trips, you know, so when I'm here at the office, it's actually very nice, you know, because you don't need to go anywhere, you know, and, and everything comes to you. Mm -hmm. You don't need to go mm -hmm. to, uh, to everyone, you know, so it's, uh, so it's actually very nice being at the office. Um, so since I saw you, which was right at the beginning of the first launch of the collection, um, what was great is we've been able to open that collection in many different cities in the US. So we did uh, Los Angeles, uh, we did uh, Miami, we did New York City, and uh, tonight we're doing Paris, uh, we did London also, and soon enough we're going to do Moscow. So the collection apparently is doing very well. Baker, the Baker organization seems very happy. So I'm very happy. So that table was a dining table and I just ordered different kind of legs, you know, to make it as a very large coffee table. Mm -hmm. So you see that's not a typical desk because that's my desk. Actually. What's usually going on in this room? All the meetings, all the meetings. That's where I sit, you know, that's where I work, that's where I meet, you know. And then you have that big TV screen there for all the Skype meetings, you know, with, uh, with all the international projects. Conference table, uh, where I sit, not very often, but we use it as a big surface, you know, to lay down, you know, all the samples. People always come to you and they ask you to copy what you've done in the past. Where, in our mind, we always like to actually go to the next step to, we, we like to provide those, those new clients some new looks, you know, some new ideas, some new, you know, new design, you know, we don't, we don't want to, uh, there's nothing interesting about duplicating something which has been done before. And the library, mm -hmm. I love books, but it's, I do like a scanner, you know, I, once I read one, mm -hmm. I know what's in there, and after it stays, you know, up there in my, in my mind, my brain, and so I don't feel obliged, you know, to go back to it, you know, it's not necessary. Studying contemporary was just not enough. So I started to educate myself about classicism. Then I, I started, you know, doing pretty classic stuff. But then as soon as you know how to do it, then, you know, it's kind of like there's no more frustration, you know, so you, you can move apart from it, you know, you can move further away from it. That's a custom design office. Mm -hmm. Another decoration office. So there's a base which is, that's the common thread, is uh, the, there's still a classical base which is becoming more and more invisible, you know, more I go forward, you know. Mm -hmm. And I'm hoping that that classical base will disappear as much as possible in the future. You know? But it's, it will still be there, you know, but you won't be able to tell. Architect office. And then you have management here with normally my business partner, my sister there, the accountant, Maxime. And yeah, we're showing around. And I our dear Susanna, who's the queen of the castle. <laughs> Et voilà. Uh, is it important for you to be great? Yes. <laughs> Other question? <laughs> yeah, why not? Uh, there's worse than being called, you know, the, kill, the king of, of decoration, you know? It's pretty good. It was very nice to meet you, Design Made, you know. Come back, you know, come back soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>